I just thought that I should um, make a little video. I was like, I thought I should do this. I thought I should. I thought it warranted a video rather than just a picture of this awesome piece of art that my daughter Sarah, nine years old, made for me tonight. We watched the Allens tonight. It's on Tubi. It was if amazing. If you have Tubi, be sure to check it out. If you don't have Tubi, get it and check it out. You know, I'm becoming a Tubi fan, a very big Tubi fan. On, on, Before you did. Incidentally, yeah. I think we should get our own movies on, on Tubi. I need to look into that. I've always had an interest in Gigi. Uh, I've been in touch with his brother Merle. Got some Gigi merchandise from him in the past. Not so much the music, honestly. Some of it I like, but it's not something that I would put in my car and listen to while I'm driving. Well, there was a book on you. Um, but just like adult films, I'm not a fan of them. But you always watch adult things. Well, adult things. I don't. I mean, like adult movies, not just. Movies that have swearing and violence or whatever in it that makes and it adult, but you know. Nudeness. Anyways, it's not the nudeness. movie and the act that I'm interested in necessarily. It's the people and the humanity that goes into making them. What makes these people tick? What makes them do uh, that kind of material? What makes them want to do that? Um, does it bother them that it may be limiting their future possibilities, jobs, whatever, um, people's opinions of them, and yeah, and so on. Anyway, I was not prepared for this awesomeness that um, Sarah brought in to the room while I was watching it the second time tonight. Go ahead and show everybody. I'm going to show them the envelope I put in for you first. It was in an envelope. Here it is. That envelope. The A is a pentagram, as right. you can clearly see right now. And here is the drawing. And if you can't tell already, this is his gravestone. That's his gravestone. And yeah. also, if you didn't, do you know what this is? Do you know why I put that there? A uh, broken bottle? Yeah. Why, why'd you put it there? Because remember, cause remember when we were watching the movie, in the credits he was singing When I Die, and he said, um, something related to, like, put you in being by my gravestone. That's right. And on that side of the drawing is the note that he had given his mother. Yeah. While he was in jail for Mother's Day. Which he was in really, jail. That's was the thing. Was he in jail twice or yes. something? He was in jail At twice. At least twice, but in the movie it was mentioned twice. Yes. Yeah. So these are the things that the, the letter to his mother are the things you don't hear about. You never heard about on, uh, on TV, in the news, uh, about Gigi. And, and that's my interest in, uh, in people like like Gigi and in, in, in his family. And I didn't only get this idea to put this there only by the song. I got that idea by because of the song and because of fan art someone drew of it. Oh, okay. Did you actually like, bash the microphone in the movie or did he not do that in the movie? Um, it didn't really emphasize that, but he... But he did, though? Right. In the other person's art, they actually put a bloody microphone and, like, a blood puddle by it. And instead of just making it just, like, a normal microphone that someone would use to sing, they made, like, a dent in it because of how many times they he bashed it into his head. Mm -hmm. And obviously, I included his tattoos. And what's, what's that there in his crotch? Because I'm not going to draw his genitals out. I understand. Just wondering. And can you tell what these just letters are? Um. I'm going to flip it so that you can see it hmm. well. So get my glasses it. so I can see it a little better. Yeah. Scum. Beep. Yes. That's what I thought. Life sucks and scum beeps. Right. So to wrap this up, what are your thoughts about the whole movie? Obviously you were influenced and... and you are, are you now a fan of Gigi? Yeah. Yes, Sarah is now a Gigi fan. Yes, I am. Um, a big one at that. A big one? Awesome. Because if I wasn't a fan of Gigi Allen, Jesus Christ Allen, apparently, then I wouldn't have grown this whole thing. That's right. That's right. And what's ironic is when I was about and your age. I wasn't a big Gigi fan. 
then I wouldn't have put in all the detail I put in. Because if I wasn't a big fan of it, then I wouldn't have added like the red to the pentagram, the blood and the dent in his forehead. Well, I was going to say what's ironic is that when I was about your age, I did, a, I did a drawing like that for my aunt. And I slipped it under her bedroom door too. Um, and that was a that was a drawing of of Jesus on the cross, hmm. like like Gigi is in in Sarah's drawing. So, wow. Also, tomorrow, if you like this, I'm definitely gonna draw another one. There you go. Definitely gonna draw another one. Well, guys, I just felt uh, it was necessary to share this with you guys. I'm just. I'm thrilled, and I knew if I just posted a picture of the drawing itself, my 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 emotion wouldn't come through, and and I'm sure there'd be some that that had something to say about it, like oh she's just nine years old and uh, I'm leading her down the wrong path, and what is she being exposed to in that house? I really don't know what I'm being exposed to. What did you just do? Nothing. So. Why Don't you shelter your, your children. Be there with your children to Why explain you your everything. Hand? If it's something you, you enjoy, so make sure it is. It is hot in here. Wipe Make yourself, sure you explain please. and <laughs> here. Wipe your nose, especially. Night, guys. Thanks for watching.